Welcome back everybody, this is Always back with another video on the channel and today we're talking about Ionic again. So I was building this application which I'm going to actually launch on a Play Store. So I've actually created the course of this whole uh, project where how you build this application from scratch. So basically this is an expense logger application where you can click on this plus button and you can type some amount and then give some description. So I'll say food cost and then you can select the type so i'll just say food click on add and now here we have you know uh, dates where you can select on a, you know date specific uh, expenses also we have some filters here here's a filter by you know category or type you can call it so if i tap on this in this input field i'm expecting only uh, a numeric values or decimal point now i was struggling how to achieve this there were plugins that you could use but we had some issues and I finally figured out how to actually do it now for that I'm actually going to just comment out or actually get rid of this line of code and uncomment this line of code then I'll explain to you guys what I've done so I'm gonna save this it's going to refresh the application obviously I'm using Ionic 4 here guys and here if I click now you can see I have this numeric keyboard with the decimal point there are two things that you need to install let me check this to package.json file and here we have this cordova plugin decimal key that's what you need and then also you need to install that as a plugin so here we have a cordova plugins and there you go here we have a decimal key okay now uh, here's the package guys you need to install and you will see the information so first of all you need to do np install ios decimal keyboard uh, and here is a usage now the difference is which i was not really you know looking at i was using a you know component from ionic so i was using this ion uh, input instead of just a simple input now if i say here ion dash input now this thing is not gonna work that was the main issue that i was facing so i hope this video is gonna help all you gotta do is just use a simple input tag and then here you'll define a type as text you're gonna do a pattern zero to nine with the strategy and here is an attribute decimal is equal to true okay so once you type that this will actually inject the decimal point in the keyboard now here basically i have these two more attributes for the tag so it says button character which i've said the dot you can do any other character and here we can say decimal character dot as well and once you do this you will be able to see that input uh field bringing up the keyboard with this numeric and the decimal point and guys if you want to know how to build this amazing application i'm actually launching a course on udemy which uh, you will see the link in the description below um, yeah, this is a full-fledged project-based course where we'll start from scratch building this whole application. That course is basically from development to deployment, covers everything with Ionic 4 uh, framework and you do a cross-platform mobile development. Okay, right, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe to the channel. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below and yeah, give a like if you like the video. Thanks for watching. I'll talk to you guys in the next one.